as it starts going. Ridiculous, massive Alcon brakes. Probably not good for today. <laughs> That's like the most yeah. of this versus that ever. partner with Chemical Guys because what you don't know is this location is a mess. Very dirty. We can't send everybody home with their cars looking like trash because we made them bring out their pride and joy and race it for you guys. So Chemical Guys makes a wide variety of products, everything you need to keep your car looking fresh. You can have a wrap, you can have high gloss paint. Chemical Guys has something to cover every single one of them. And today, we're talking about Swift Wipe Waterless Car Wash. You can use this as an alternative method for your traditional car wash. Spray it on any surface, let it sit for 10 seconds, then you just wipe it off with a clean microfiber rag. Brand new. So Head over to Chemical Guys YouTube channel. They have thousands of videos showing how to use their products. They're actually really cool and you learn some stuff. They also have retail stores all over the United States and Canada called Detail Garage where they stock all these products. And if you're not local to any of these Detail Garage locations, you could still pick them up at your local AutoZone, Walmart, even on Amazon. Click the link below to learn more about Chemical Guys and see some before and afters. But first, finish watching this episode, then go click the link. Oh. Welcome back to another episode of This First That presented by our good friends at NOS Energy Drink. Slow down, man. Today's episode, we've got a sick matchup. Oh, I'm so excited about this. You're excited for different reasons than I'm excited. I'm excited for one driver and one car. Actually, I'm excited for both cars, but maybe rooting for one more than the I, other. I'm rooting for one car more than the other. Can we just go see what's going on? Uh, yeah, I'd rather go look at the cars. Let's go look at the cars. Talk. Holy crap. Hold on, I just want to say something. Beyond the car, look who we have. Formula Drift champion, unlimited Pikes Peak champion, Tokyo Drift driver. He's done cars for Hyundai, Lexus, all sorts of manufacturers. Now he's getting down with the Bentley boys. Yeah, Reese Millen, is... how are you, I mean, my friend? Good. That was <laughs> sorry, that was such sorry. an you intro. Do this. I know, <laughs> this I know. Dude, what did you bring here today? So this is Bentley's GT3 race car that they race in Europe and raced in the US. But this one is being tweaked for Time Attack Racing owned by Be Faster in the UK. So it's a highly modified GT3 car. Step away from the GT3 racing series, go to Pikes Peak, and now there's no rules, there's no restrictions. So big turbos, big waste gates, big aero. Look at this freaking <laughs> aero setup, dude. I've never seen canards this big. Is this just a rear wing chopped in half for the front? Yeah, pretty much. I think they saw a picture of my dad's old Celica from uh, 1994. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what the downforce numbers are, but effectively when you go to altitude for every thousand feet that you climb, you lose three percent of not only engine performance but air density so that's also downforce oh, so wow. by the time you get to the top the air is so thin that you need to create be creating that much more downforce yep. you're starting at 9,000 feet ending at 14,000 so the effective downforse gets chopped almost nothing. Thanks, Thanks Bill Nye. Bill Nye sucks butthole. I love Damn race it. cars and how like the hood and the, the cooling system is built into the aero package. Yeah. Like the evac from the cooling system is the coolest thing ever. Pun intended. Can we pop this hood? Does it come off pretty easy or no? I don't yeah. want to touch it. It comes, this is, comes this off easy. I'll tell you one. this engine is low. Wait for the gas. Holy oh, crap! Oh my goodness. What engine is it? Is it a Bentley engine? Yeah, it's a sheared platform between Audi and Bentley. So this is the four liter uh, Bentley motor that's available as the V8 option, or they have the six liter W12. So I'm imagining it's got a sequential. Yeah, it's a six speed uh, Ricardo, uh, the transaxle, clutch, starter motor, alternator, everything is actually in the back. Oh, sick. What do we got here for the for the wheels? It's square, so it's 325s uh, all the way around. And then you so got some sick. ridiculous, massive Alcon brakes. Probably not good for today, but they still <laughs> work really good on the mountain. You guys at home can't feel this, but this door has to weigh like ounces. You can't feel it either. Don't you, you're not worthy to touch uh, this thing. You tell all your girlfriends. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't have been talking shit. GT3 spec 
cage and safety and everything already put in place? It, everything no, is. So the, the pedal box assembly is actually on a slider. There's a carbon <laughs> rod down the side. So to keep your CG um, low and centered right where you want it, when you do a driver change, you pull the pedal box assembly to wow. the driver so I can rather than it. sliding the seat forward. You That's how much that a, that a driver can affect. It will, you'll be able to drive this no problem. You'll dance yeah. like you're the perfect size. Is that brake fluid? No, it's actually uh, oil and vinegar for salad. Vegetarians, let's go. Oh, so when you're making salads <laughs> at the start line. Nice. Yeah, that's, Can you toss my salad? No, no, that's right. Well, that got weird. It means sucking my ass. Is there anything to check out on the back besides this massive arrow from the outside? Yeah, Jesus. so a couple of things that were done specifically for Pikes Peak because, again, we're running at atmospheric conditions that are less air density. They put a radiator in the back on top of the one that is in the front and then ran the side scoops, 3D printed the side scoops, and then 3D printed the oh ducts, and God. then out the rear end. So it was all safety measures from running production cars the previous years that we found that we were very close to terminal on oil temps, on water temps, mm. and everything. So all of that went in here, all of it was used, and we had no issues during the race. Um, Have you ever drag raced this thing before? One. Yeah, there's a couple of straightaways at Pikes Peak. This is why we partner with Chemical Guys. This car came out of an enclosed trailer and did just a couple passes. So, this place is filthy. Why would you <laughs> smear it like that? It's a race car! <laughs> the disrespect. Have you seen what you're racing yet? Guess I'm getting a glimpse, but I did not know until about five minutes ago. It's uh, nothing like this. Let's go look at it. What's up, dude? How's Who it are going? you and what'd you bring here today? My name's Alex. I have a 2019 Honda Civic Type R. Been built by JSR Engines up in West Covina. They did an ad <laughs> cylinder head. Currently, it's holding down a stack of manila envelopes. <laughs> on I'm desk. working on it. I'm working on it. I'm working on phase two. But found this car at the shop. Looks very stock, but there's some pretty cool goodies underneath it. Let's take a Alex, look. Alex, you want to show us? All right, so right off the bat, that's not stock. <laughs> if you didn't paint the valve cover, I think we right. could have pulled something off. Yeah, yeah. So what are we looking at here, man? So we have a K20C1. Um, um, fully built engine, um, sleeves, pistons, ported head. You um, say it's a K20, but this is nothing like the K-swaps that people are putting in other cars, right? Like this correct. is a completely different engine. Com completely, yes. Rampage Turbo Kid. What turbo? What size turbo? Uh, K25, I believe it's a 45 millimeter? Okay, 45, so it's a Garrett. Garrett. It's got a yeah. V-band housing, yeah. internal wastegate. How what? much power? Right now, I believe we're in the 550, 600 to the wheels. Is it a stock engine? Stock bottom end, yes. Stock okay. bottom end. What about trans? You got upgraded, limited slip, anything? Bone stock, stock, stock really? trans. Stock Stock ECU? A running um, Honda 50 50 mix of e E85. Why not full beans? You can, not yet. No? Not right now, unfortunately. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. right now we're, we're topped out at uh, 50 mix. Max is out, the high yeah. pressure fuel yeah. pump? The high pressure fuel Well, we actually we upgraded to the XDI fuel pump. Originally, we had the Honda fuel system, the whole fuel kit. Yeah. It wasn't strong enough. So we had to go in with the XDI, it would give yeah. us a little bit more. No one's just converting strict port injection on these yet? Nothing yet, not, not, not yet. Does this still heat soak like the, uh, like the standard it setup? It does, it does heat okay. soak, but I do have a couple of um, well, Let's do 10 passes. <laughs> 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 this is turbo weather right now. Right, yes, exactly. It's really good for is turbo that, Is the intercore stock? No, it's a uh, PRL. But you, cooler. you, you painted it though, so yeah, I don't, like I, it looks stock. super, it super looks low stock, key. Yeah. What are you working with as far as like you got any weight reduction, Tires, anything wheels, else done to it? No, nope. it's a uh, daily. Daily, it's my daily. Nice. We well, got Titan Sevens. Yeah. Shout out to those guys. What tires? I, I have the the Bridgestone. Which ones are they? We just put these on actually. It's a RE seventy one. Yeah. Oh, those are yeah, sticky. RE seventy ones. Yep. What else you got going on on the inside? Anything? Stock. Completely Bone stock. stock. Bone stock. With the Look red seats though. This is a gnarly sleeper. Yeah, this is a pretty, <laughs> this is a pretty yeah, low Got my baby's car seat sometimes in the back. Is that, you know? is that not a this versus, that's like the most yeah. of this versus that ever right now. I want to see them race. Let's go for this. Now, you don't like to go from a dig, right? You're kind of more of a, a, a Mexico highway, yeah, highway roll? Yeah, mostly roll. We, okay. I've never really done, I've never done a launch on it yet. So never done a launch never on it yet. Never done a launch on okay. it yet. Okay. I'll launch okay. it for you. Let's do a dig. If Let's go do from a dig. A dig. Go, Let's yeah, start from a dig. Reese really wants to give you a roll. <laughs> <laughs> I know he does. Yeah, we'll go 1500 then on a dig. All right. Whoa. Nice, oh, that's big money man. right off the bat. <laughs> He's telling the truth or not if his car doesn't dig well. It's not meant for that. It's got a lot of aero. Reese Millen driving. I'm gonna go with Reese. I think Reese might have this one, but especially if we're going all the way out to the 1500, but I still gotta I gotta go for FK at CTR. Alex and the Civic will reign supreme. It's kind of tough, because that's a mean sleeper, and this is not designed for this. But I want this to win, because I love it. 
This is easy Reese, dude. Have you seen how many air ducts how wide are in is this it? thing? I don't want it to break an axle or fry his clutch or any of that sort of stuff, right, Alex? You gotta make it home. He said it's a daily driver. It is my daily. <laughs> so I, you sure you wanna dig? Let's do the dig, let's do the dig. It's gonna get ugly. I'm gonna go for me. I'm gonna win. Roll race, done deal. Dig race, he's gonna have to walk him down, Bentley. What do we got going on here, Vin? We're doing a calf shootout right now. Why Can you guys turn around, around for us? Ooh. Oh, oh, come on, Lewis. I can't compete with Diego. Yes, come on, Bring Lewis. Oh, God oh. damn. Speed. Delicious boys. We need like booty pants, but for calves. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, You're gonna hurt something. Is anybody else getting a bit of a chub right now? <laughs> Maybe from a roll. Let me Maybe tell from you. a roll. Let hey, me tell hey you. there's no losers here, man. My yeah, boy's gonna right. drive home. The thing Multi-million that makes dollar this show race good car. is if the stock looking car beat the crazy looking car. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Dude, this thing is young fast. I think I, I think we give the Civic the hit. I think, think we should go roll. Thousand foot in the hit, I think is a fair. Yeah, let's thousand, do that. Thousand foot in the hit. Yeah, and we go from a dig again. Okay. And okay. then we'll do a roll after. And that. then we can do a let's roll consult. after that. Let's right. consult. Okay. We're thinking about giving you the hit and okay. shortening it to a thousand feet. Thousand. Did, did you have him at the thousand? I did. Oh, definitely. All right, here it is. Second race, thousand foot. Honda gets the hit. Oh, fire! Fire! It's a race car. That's Right when the cars are warmed up, yeah. Unfortunately, uh, the car's been sitting for a week at uh, Pebble Beach and the battery's flat. We tried hooking up another battery, but now it's just giving me a warning. It's just not running at full power. We'll yeah. do a roll instead so of a dig, though, Reese. Going, yeah. Okay. Wait a second. Are you the roll race guy? I mean, I've tested the car the most out of everybody while it's been at our shop, so I kind of know, like, here and there with the car. Nice. All right. Here. Driver mod. Reese needs a driver swab. You the man? Jump in. Let's go. I don't know what any of those things do in that car, but I'll go. You want to have a catch? I'd like that. <laughs> So as you know, on this versus that, we like to take one wild car and match it against a very different car. But sometimes the wild cars are a little too much for a simple drag race show because they require so much stuff. And Reese Millen brought a very wild vehicle here that is not designed for drag racing. So long story short, now you get to go home and say you be multi-time <laughs> Formula Just champion. <laughs> Pike's Peak record-breaking monster. Everything he touches, he destroys. You, you and your Honda Civic beat this. Yeah, yeah, you got road, bro. Yeah.
got a road. <laughs> Bentley Slayer. <laughs> Good job, man. Good I'm job. Taking. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me tell you a little story about a guy named Soichiro Honda and everything that he's done in order to. <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Guys, just watch history. So this versus that is all about odd matchups. It doesn't get any odder than that.